What is going on guys, Grave here today. Let's talk about housing in the Elder Scrolls Online and how many of the housing fans in the ESO community are wanting to see a housing update of some sort. Um, whether you're a housing fan or not, you have to admit housing has been very popular since it was introduced and it has gained a lot of popularity since it has been introduced. It's something that when Zoss added it in, I don't know if everyone really understood how much popularity it was going to gain, how many people in the community were just going to be fans of housing and you know decorating and that kind of thing. There's been a lot of things on the channel that I have talked about over the years that I would like to see added into housing. There's a lot of things that people in the community are talking about, kind of some of the same ideas over the years. A lot of people want to see the same thing. So let's go ahead and talk about a few of these things that the community is wanting to see. First of all, the option to set a day-night cycle in your home. So if you decorate with you know, some really cool looking lights and you want to be able to see what it's going to look like at night, you actually can swap that to a night cycle or vice versa. If you're wanting to see how something looks in the daytime, you would have the ability once in your home to you know, kind of change that day and night cycle and maybe even set a time on that. Another thing a lot of people have been discussing over the years is uh, more like structure building options. The ability to combine items we already have in game or the ability to have more control over exactly how you want to you know how you want to build a certain structure so if you want to have a i guess more of a in-depth you know kind of building tool option there when it comes to structures or like i said a lot of people want the ability to be able to combine items we already have and actually be able to kind of break that down to make you know two or three items into one and have the option to make that look you know like something that's actually supposed to be there uh, another thing that i talked about a lot uh, that i know a lot of people in the community want is guild hall options and i've already said this in the past I, I think we should actually have you know housing and guild halls be a separate thing but actually have guild halls be available in, in you know housing as well where you can buy you know you have your own personal homes but you also if you're a guild owner or if you're someone just in a guild and you would like to purchase a guild hall for your guild you would have the ability to do that. And, you know, the guild could actually go in together and buy it that way. It's not like one person's guild, you know, home. It's actually the entire guild's home. And have more options to make it, you know, kind of feel like something that a guild would be in. You know, not just a, a home, but, you know, a castle or whatever the case may be. The option to have more people there as well. Uh, the option to have, you know, different things, you know, that would just be for guilds maybe within that home you know within that guild hall and I, I think that would be a very unique feature you can still have your own personal homes but you also can have the option to have a guild hall that's just you know for your guilds another thing that a lot of people have talked about over the years and one thing that i would really like to see is either the option to have farms or gardens or just more land in general around your home a lot of the homes we have are really small they really don't have a big outside area some of the homes we have are really large and have a smaller to, you know, medium size outside area. I think some people would like to see smaller or medium homes with large outside areas, you know, more of a landmass where you could have farms or gardens. Uh, when it comes to farms, we have a lot of access to, you know, different mounts and pets we have. So, you know, you could have almost a farm kind of set up if you had more options with those or what you could do with those uh, pets or mounts. And also the option to have a garden would be a really cool thing. Also, one thing that I have really wanted to see in the game over the years is more smaller and medium sized homes. I talked about this in some of my housing videos before. Some of the large homes I have are really cool. One, the one I use right now for the guild hall and my guild on PS5 is one of the larger homes. But at the same time, I enjoy decorating and, and doing things with these smaller and medium style homes because they look more full in my opinion. Some of those larger homes, you just do not have enough furniture options right now unless they add more furniture options down the road to how much you can have in a house. They just look a little bit empty. And I think the smaller and medium sized homes look a hundred times better once you get them decorated. Um, the last thing uh, that I kind of want to hit on real quickly is two things that I've seen people talking about a lot lately. And that is housing rewards in the daily reward system. I think that would be a great option to have. I know not everyone participates in housing, but for all the housing fans out there, I think if Zoss decided to put a few housing rewards in the daily rewards, that would be something that a lot of people would really like to see. And last but not least, a homestead anniversary event. This has been something that's being, being discussed in the ESO community right now. I've seen a lot of people talking about this. We have events for everything in game. 
And a lot of people are hoping Zoss will add an actual homestead events, you know, kind of on the anniversary of when they added housing into the game, have some type of an event that is just kind of tailored towards housing. I think that would be a really unique, neat idea. And it would be something different than we already have in game. You know, it would be a bit different than all the other events we had. So a homestead anniversary event, I think, is a really good idea. If you have any other thoughts about housing, leave me a comment down in the comment section. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you hadn't subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.